Hello everybody, it's Grateful here, and today we're going to review the Dutes 745 RTS version 1.3 Combine mod for Farming Simulator 2015, guys. Okay, there is two different versions of this Combine, guys. There is a wheeled version and there is a tracked version of this Combine, guys, and they're uh, priced a little bit different and have different headers for each, guys. So, okay, let's go ahead and go to the store, guys, and uh, check these guys out in the store. Um, oops, we have to go to the mods. All right, guys, and uh, the uh, the tank the, the tracked version is two hundred thirty thousand and has a capacity of um, nine thousand six hundred and fifty. Oh, it is two hundred thirty thousand. Yes, and has a capacity of nine thousand six hundred fifty and uh, has uh, five hundred seventy one horsepower, which is going to be the same um, for the other one. And then here is the wheeled version. It is two hundred four thousand nine hundred ninety nine. About. Uh, 25,000 euros cheaper than the uh, than its counterpart with the track tires and uh, um, I believe it's suitable for the smaller heads but it also has a bit smaller grain capacity of 9,500 only about 150 less uh, on the grain capacity let's check out the headers for these thing this thing uh, these things guys um, the 7 meter header which is uh, um, you know pretty good for the small wheeled work version um, is 39,999 about 40,000 the larger version which is meant for the tank or track version is uh, 70,000 guys okay and then the corn headers on um, the six row uh, meant for the wheeled version is uh, 14,000 and the uh, um, the 12 row meant for the uh, uh, the tracked version is uh, 35,000 guys and uh, so let's actually go out and uh, see how these things work in the fields guys so um, this one here is ready to go on some wheat guys and it has kind of an interesting feature um, once you get inside of the cab and get it running. Well, let's just test it out. Uh, here's the uh, here's the uh, beacon lights. Those are all pretty nice, guys. Uh, the horn. We got that standard buzzer horn. Um, the inside and the cab looks very nice. Uh, uh, digital's got a never-ending supply of monster here. Um, but also, guys, see this little uh, um, this little red and green little bar here across the top. Um, when we start the combine, um, that's going to let us know how far. Um, we are off, or um, how far we're off. Like if we if we let the left side come over here, it's going to tell us that we need to actually move over to the left because we're missing some. So that's pretty neat when you don't have to keep your eyes on it. You can actually keep your eyes forward, and then when you get back, it'll tell you you're inside the center area. And now I'm actually cutting a little bit shy on this side, and it tells me I could get back in there a little bit more. Um, it's it's pretty nice to to uh, um, to help you keep in the center zone. While uh, um, while combining and, and not have to watch the side of the header, um, and you know that's that's uh, it's very nice. It's a, um, a very nice feature and uh, quite enjoy it. it. It's everything in the dash works, guys. The uh, the mirrors work. Uh, it's a very good mod, guys. Uh, um, completely enjoyable. We'll be using it on the stream and on the farm. But uh, let's go ahead and uh, switch over to the uh, switch over to the corn, and then we'll unfold this one. And unfold the uh, harvester and I'll tell you the thing that I don't like about this combine so far guys okay so let's go ahead and start it up so we're gonna unfold it and see that that just kind of comes out of nowhere there guys that uh, um, that grain auger let's fold it back up and kind of show you what I mean but uh, um, actually when you dump the uh, when you dump the grain in there um, it uh, um, you don't see it actually pile up until like you're at 10%. So I mean, I, I kind of don't like that either. But uh, um, you know, we'll go ahead and unfold it again. We'll go ahead and fold the uh, corn header. We'll start this thing up and do a little bit of combine here. But this does seem to be a fairly nice model, guys. I completely enjoy it. Um, it's going to be a, a nice little um, medium range combine. Um, I do believe that's going to be a lot of fun. Um, I hope you guys enjoy it. There will be a link for the combine down there, guys. And until next time, um, peace, love, and beard grease, guys.